I'm sentencing you to Mayberry Fest. Golly! Welcome to Mayberry Fest! Hey there, Court Howell here, producer of Mayberry Man, with another behind the scenes update. And today, it's all about announcements. Are you ready? Let's go. We just released the official Mayberry Man trailer, and if you haven't seen it yet, I'll share that with you in just a moment. But first, let's talk about some important dates that you may want to be aware of. After careful consideration, we've decided to schedule all of our VIP red carpet screening events for September of this year to allow more time for COVID restrictions to lift and for people to get vaccinated and feel comfortable gathering indoors again. We're putting together a very special event and we want everyone to be able to fully enjoy it. Our first red carpet event is scheduled for Saturday, September 4th in Danville, Indiana. That's Labor Day weekend. Then we'll do our Los Angeles screening in mid-September, followed by our Mount Airy red carpet event the week of Mayberry Days. And that could be as early as Wednesday, September 22nd, or even as late as Sunday the 26th. We know a lot of people travel in for Mayberry Days, so we're trying to finalize that date just as soon as possible. Now, this means that backer rewards will also be distributed in September. They'll be available for pickup at the red carpet events, or they'll be shipped shortly thereafter, so late September or early Early October. And finally, after the red carpet screenings, then we'll do our pre-release online screening. So expect that to happen in early October. Now, if you're in the Indianapolis area, we have a special event coming up May 15th, hosted by the Meridian Street Foundation at the Old Governor's Mansion, where we shot part of the movie. It's a garden party where you can hang out with tribute artists, meet the producers and cast members, plus special guest Karen Knotts will be sharing stories about her father, Don Knotts. Entertainment will also include three live bands, including a special appearance by country star Levi Riggs, who's recording a special Mayberry song for the movie. There will be food, drinks, and you can even pick up some cool memorabilia at the silent auction. Proceeds from this event will help pay for finishing the movie. You can buy your tickets by going to supportmaybearyman.com or directly to mayberryonmeridian.com. We really expect this to be a wonderful time, so hope you can make it. Back in the fall of 2019, we began reaching out to you, the fans, to help raise the funds to make this movie because we didn't want Hollywood calling the shots on this one. And you answered the call with generous donations and a massive volunteer effort that made this movie possible. We also gained the support of other Mayberry legacies, like Andy Griffith's daughter, Dixie. She's one of our executive producers. Karen Knotts, the daughter of Don Knotts, she's in the movie, and Goober's son, George Lindsay Jr. And on top of all that, Laura Hagen, wife of composer Earl Hagen, is generously allowing us to use Earl's original Andy Griffith Show music in our musical score. Thanks to all of you, we raised enough money to film a movie and provide once-in-a-lifetime experiences for many of you who joined us in the production while others of you enjoyed behind-the-scenes access from the comfort of your own homes as we live-streamed from the set. Now, I can tell you today with confidence that what we captured on film is truly special, but you don't have to take my word for it. Take a look at our official trailer. Hi, Hi. Craig, give me the elevator pitch. Hey, okay. picture this. Chris Stone is a Hollywood movie star. You're Chris Stone! Yes, thank you. I am Chris Dunn. Living life in the fast lane. I didn't know it was his daughter. Mr. Stone. But all of that is about to change. All rise. You were observed driving 105 miles per hour in a 45 mile per hour zone. I'm sentencing you to Mayberry Fest. Golly! Welcome to Mayberry Fest. Have you ever heard of Mayberry Fest? Dad used to go to it every year. You know what's gonna happen to me when I show up there? I'm gonna get mobbed. Mr. Chris Stone. <laughs> the son of Walter Stone from season three. <laughs> yeah. Cal. No. Clay. No. Howdy. Cliff. I'm Chris Stone. No, that's not it. <laughs> you two are gonna love it. <laughs> Mr. Stone? Hey. We are glad to have you, Nick. 
Chris. You're a regular guy. How would you make a move on her? I don't think I would make a move on her. I'd probably just, you know, try and get to know her first. You have really good coffee here. I don't drink coffee. Oh, okay. Why isn't there a Mr. Kate? Why isn't there a Mrs. Stone? I don't care about Mayberry Fest. I certainly don't care about dad or his career. He's your dad, man. No, he was your dad. How good am I? You don't understand. No, I understand. You're a bigger phony than I thought you were. There comes a time in everyone's life when things get complicated. Mayberry isn't just a place, it's a state of mind. It's in Georgia, it's in Indiana, it's even in California. Hey Dad, guess where I am? I'm at Mayberry Fest. Shazam! Isn't that exciting? We did it, right? Well, almost. The trailer's finished, but the movie is not. We have completed the editing process. The story, the performances, they're all there. So we know we have something very special. But editing is just one step of the post-production process. The trailer you just watched had to go through several additional processes to actually get it to look and sound the way it does. Today, we're asking for your help again because our post-production costs are going up as we take extra steps to make Mayberry Man the best it can possibly be. Now, it's not easy asking for more help, but we feel that Mayberry Man has surpassed expectations, and it really does need that extra polish that will separate it from being just another quirky, low-budget movie. We feel that we owe that to you because you're the ones that made this movie so special to begin with. Now, it's very common in filmmaking to need additional funds during post-production. However, we don't have a Hollywood studio to turn to for help. That's why we're doing another round of crowdfunding. We've set a new goal with a deadline and new ways to become a backer of the movie. And while we do need to raise additional funds, no one should feel pressured or obligated. We couldn't have gotten this far without your generous support, and we are forever grateful. So if you're already a backer, we ask that you help by sharing the project with others. And if you're not a backer yet and still want to participate, we would love to have you join our team. The funds raised will go toward areas of post-production that directly impact the quality of the finished film. And any excess funds will go toward distribution of the movie, so we can get it out to the public as soon as possible. You know, 18 months ago, when we first asked for your help, all we had was an idea and a script. But today, we know we have something very, very special. And we don't want to compromise. We want to do what it takes to finish it right and deliver the best film possible for you. I invite you to check out our new backer opportunities and help us reach our new fundraising goal. And we can't wait to share the finished movie with you a little later this year. On behalf of the entire Mayberry Man team, thank you for your support. Mayberry Man is uh, like a dream come true for Mayberry fans like me. I've been a part of the, the Mayberry world for over 20 years, and, and to, for something like this to come up and to get to be a part of, it is absolutely amazing. You need to do it. It is so much fun, and it is a great thing to get involved in. Absolutely loved being a part of this. It was a big new adventure for me. It's not too late to support us. Go to supportmayberryman.com. I'll see you there. And if you haven't backed the movie yet, it's not too late. Oh, no, it's not. Yeah. I, I you highly know recommend it and become yeah. part of our Mayberry family. Yeah. There's no experience like it in the world. Oh, that's so nice. Hey, y'all. George Lindsay Jr. here. Mayberry Man the movie is coming soon, and it's going to be a good one. Goober says hey. Hey there, I am so excited about the Mayberry Man movie project. It is going to be absolutely amazing. I hope that you'll consider supporting it like I am. It's gonna be incredible. So I, I guarantee this, if you love the Andy Griffith show, you're gonna love Mayberry Man. And it's gonna need a group effort. And you know, if we can put the effort in there, we're gonna end up with a really good product. So if you'd like to support us again or support us for the first time, just visit supportmayberryman.com. 
That's it for this edition of Mayberry Man Behind the Scenes. Until next time, thanks for watching. Thank <laughs> you.